All right, so you're trying to use Adobe Premiere Pro CS6, C, uh, CC15, CC12, CS5, whatever you have that you can afford. Sometimes you want to edit a video and it's just not letting you, you know? So you try to open your folders where all your videos at, and then you try to drag it in here. Oh look, I have the video and audio for that one, but that's not the one I want. Let's, uh, let's grab this one, because this is the one I want. Why is there no video? Oh look it, there's the audio. <laughs> there's no video. <laughs> so for the CC users, CC12, CC15, there's gonna be like these little highlighted box and I'll show you in like a second, but basically you click on both of them to make sure they're on video and audio. It's gonna highlight like this, just make sure yours are enabled. But for people like w with me with CS6 or CS5, whatever, we don't have that yet uh and then when you import it here it's nothing but audio if you import it here and then you try to put it in here it's nothing but audio but it is in fact an mp4 so like it works you can see the video and yes that's ray nervous jr why am i telling you the long story basically the thing what happened with this mp4 and this mp4 is the codec that's the problem at least in my case you can try to, you can use MOVs, MOVs still work perfectly fine for you, um, because they go under a different codec, uh, but with MP4s, there's different codecs that go along with it, and if you're using what I'm using, <laughs> holy shit, uh, if you're using what I'm using, which is, uh, OBS, um, they they give you, like, different options for your codec, so you'd go into your settings, go to output, I believe, yeah, and then recording, so, in here, it, it, I'm recording right now, so obviously this is gonna be like really grayed out, and I'm sorry about the like blur. You have your MP4 recording format, and your encoder has to be X.264. There's other formats under this encoder, but it says like with AMD or something, uh, depending on your graphics card, NVIDIA, whatever. You have change it to just um, X.264, and then you'll get your video and your audio, and you will, and I know it works because I'm recording this video currently with these settings, and it's recording three minutes. It's really been annoying me. Also, people have said if you're doing this where you're grabbing two files from here and then you're putting it in here, to not do that, or if you're doing it from here to here, don't do that. I don't know why. Apparently it's bad practice to just double click here or you can go to your file import or recent files Whatever, but you go to import you can just go to your video whatever and then be like boop there it is That's also gonna be audio because of the stupid codec that I was using or let's say you want the video and the audio Or if you only want the video this little icon right here is drag video only this little icon is drag audio only so if I only want the audio Boom if I only want the video boom or if I want both just grab this and boom, and you get this window pop up by double clicking those. I'm not a god. If it doesn't work, I'm sorry. Hopefully it does work. You know, I'm trying to offer suggestions. That's all I know about this, but this has been annoying me for the past couple days, and I face palmed really hard when I realized what was happening. So try this, and if you have a question, let me know. I'll try to answer it. I'll try. Don't yell at me, please. <laughs> But let's see if this works. I don't think it will, but we can try. Uh, change. I just found a life hack. <laughs> if you have a bunch of files and you don't want to convert them one by one, just put MOV at the end. <laughs> I didn't even know that works. I just, I just found that out. I was just messing with it. I didn't think that would actually work. If you screw up and you put it to MP4, then just change it to MOV really quickly. But in your codec settings when you're recording, make sure that MP4 matches X264. And then if you fuck up, just put it to MOV. 